least try. At least understand what it's like to feel alone. You understand the pain. Loneliness has followed me my whole life. Everywhere. There's no escape. God does not like you. He never wanted you. In all probability, he hates you. And God's a little man. We are God's unwanted children. My pain is constant and sharp. And I do not hope for a better world for anyone. We're a generation of men raised by women. I'm wondering if another woman is really the answer to you. You have to let it all go. Just let go. She always tells me to smile. Shut up. Put on a happy face. I think my mask of sanity is about to slip. The middle children of history, man. No purpose, place. We have no great war. No great depression. Our great war is a spiritual war. How great depression. My perfect man. Let's go! Watch our lives crumbling before my eyes. But even after admitting this, there is no catharsis. My punishment continues to elude me, and I gain no deeper knowledge of myself. No new knowledge can be extracted from my telling. This confession has meant nothing. For all those moments will be lost in time, like tears in rain. Hello again. Long time now. Whatever it is we do. Sorry I haven't talked to you in a while. I missed you. Where did you go? Who are you over there? What are you hiding? I'm just an honor. I'm just alone. <sighs> the loneliness came back. Worse than I remember. I get up every morning. What's the point? If you just do stuff and nothing happens. What it all mean? I'm stuck in a repetitive, boring routine. We're just going around in circles. But I wouldn't care to be normal. What do normal people do when they get this sad? Surround themselves with people they love. With people who love them. Only oh, yeah, I can meet someone now. Hi. This is the day we met. You look lonely. Do you have a girlfriend? Can I kiss you? I missed you, baby sweet. <laughs> Are you falling in love with her? Probably enough, I do. What did I do? Did those hopeful moments scare me? Are you leaving me? We're all leaving. It's like I'm reading a book. It's a book I deeply love. But I'm reading it slowly now. The people that I love, people I trusted, then they're absolutely the worst to me. I love you so much. I can't live in your book anymore. You're the worst thing that ever happened to me.